these bags, for I need a run in seven, a Teferi, or a Meadook. Just give me one of those damn cards already, please, wizards, please. All right, what's shaking, guys? It's Felder bringing you another MTG Obsession video. <laughs> and, well, Midnight Hunt is pretty much been the bane of my existence. Now that Crimson Bell is out, I figured I would try this again. You guys saw my Halloween special where uh, I ended up striking out big time. And that was not fun because, well, let's be honest, I only am hunting for a few things. So we got the hunt, the hunt is on. Bring us luck, baby. Please, please bring us luck. All right, y'all saw the video. If you haven't, go back and check out the Halloween special. Uh, you guys know that we've got the dice here. Pretty fun stuff, right? Okay, so got the dice that glows in the dark and we got our trick a of area and some planes. All right. Nobody cares. All right, let's get these bad boys out here. Let's get this organized. Sweet baby. We're going to say that we're going to roll a two. A 16. All right, well, let's see if 16 brings us any luck here. All right, we've got eight packs to crack. Let's get to it. Come on, baby. Be nice to me here. Be nice to me. We got some art. We got our forest. And then we're gonna just kind of scroll through. We got a join the dance, and nothing. A contortionist troop, nothing. A convert cup purse. We got the two, oh, 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 oh. We got the bird admire, and we got grafted identity, and a unblinking observer. Ugh hoping that that was going to be a um a different card oh well all right one rare down one art card down we'll just go ahead and you can't see the commons there off screen all right do i want to even bother doing the uncommons maybe i should Maybe I should do the uncommons just so that way we have a little pile of uncommons as well. All right, that should be good. All right, let's keep going. Haunted Ridge, great artwork for sure. Uh, I do love the artwork cards. All right, we got the mountain, which we're just going to place land over yonder. We've got the commons over here we got the clear shot the unnatural moonrise the hound tamer oh oh i gave it away running patrol and a liar disciple of the drowned the like alternative art of that mythic that is a good little hit right there and a dire strain rampage rare in here we'll take that pack and a grizzly ghoul in foil and then our list was sleeping potion which probably not that much value but we'll go ahead and put list cards over here by uh cracking packs and underworld gaming all right so let's go ahead and keep cracking keep the cracking going baby let's go I have a whole pile of land that you guys can't even see. It's uh, over yonder and it's, oh God almighty. Come on, John. All right, got our lovely duel for dominance, our land, which again, you guys can't see the land pile, but it's over on my other side here. All right, burn the accursed and we're gonna go right into the uncommon. Dryad Revile, Revival, oh my gosh, Dualcraft Trainer, Loyal Griff, Harvest Tide Infiltrator, let's go ahead and put those three back down there for the uncommon, 
We got the Bane Blade, Bane Blade Scoundrel and the Poppet Stitcher into the Poppet Factory. And we have our second Mythic of the pack. And as you guys can tell, a Foil Morcut Behemoth. All right, all right. So far, this has been a lot better of a blessing pack than the others. We do have the Unnatural Moonrise, which really cool artwork. I mean, I will say the artwork in this series is bonkers. All right, uh -oh, there was a foil. We also are looking for that uncommon um, consider. And if you get it in foil, it's even better. Play with fire, vampire socialite, Bird Admirer, Tessing Naturalist, which does flip into Lord of Un Unveldwald. Unveldwald. Say that ten times fast. All right, Dire Horde, and a Briar Bridge Tracker, and then a Shipwreck Sifters Foil, and then we have a List Commander Loyal Apprentice. All right. All right, all right. All right, still no Meat Hook, still no Ren, still no Teferi. <sighs> all right, we got Art, we got our Planes. We've got some commons that we gotta go through here. Did I just see a list? All right. We have Borrowed Time. Defend the Celsius. Lunar Veteran. A Tavern Ruffian. Ooh, that's a nice hit. Moonvale Regent. That's our third mythic. And an Ecstatic Wakener that does flip as I hit my camera. Into Awoken Demon. Not too shabby of a pack there, y'all. I'll take that pack. We are down to three packs. Can we pull the Magic 3? I've already pulled Arlen, so I'm okay if I don't get Arlen. Speak of the devil. The Arlen art card. <sighs> A foil island. That's hard to get, y'all. I love this artwork. And islands are definitely the more rare of the lands, and a foil island is very tough to get. Um, let's put that down in our foil section. All right, here we go. Timberland Guide. Ding, 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 ding. Okay, still looking for that consider. Blood Tithe Collector. Stromkirk Blood Thief. Lunar Veteran again. Outland Liberator. Come on, baby. That's a common. Visions of Duplicity for the Commander, rare. And an Honor of Autumn, all right. Not a bad little hit. I think that card's around five to six bucks. Tavern Ruffian as a foil. I mean, the foil on that's actually not too shabby. So. Not a bad little pack there, but we won't get our big three, which we know is going to be Meat Hook, Ren, and Teferi, but Mr. T, I have a little bit of defeat in my voice, if you can't tell. I've been searching for these cards for so dang long, and I don't know. I just don't know what else to do. Like, I mean, it just, ugh. It's just really tough because it's like you want it so bad, but you don't love this set. You just want those cards and you, you want to pull them. You don't want to just go out and buy them. That, that's the problem. So we get Florian, another bulk rare, and then we get a Soul Guide Griff foil. Although, man, that foil, that foil is like on point. On point foil. Crazy. Okay. And then the spirit token. 
Blast back. Please, magic gods. Just, just please. This one pack, all I ask is that you give me a meat hook or a wren. Okay, that's all. Or a great list card right here. That would be sick. A good list card will make up for all the other crap. All the packs that I've opened in Midnight Hunt without getting a wren or a meat hook. All right, here we go, guys. Well, they're an ambush. Foul play. Kavita's Castaway. The Tireless Hollow. The Dawnheart Rejuvenator. And a Trick with the Fire. That is definitely not what I wanted to see. I mean, you can't get any worse of an ending with a Dawnheart Rejuvenator in the back and then a Gravespawn Sovereign. Not a bad list card, but not the best. Okay, well, I mean, that does it for this one. Um, I mean, we definitely had a few really decent pulls out of here. We had three Mythics. Uh, we had the Augur of Autumn, which is probably the next best. And then, yeah, you know, we got we got a couple decent pulls. Um, nothing amazing. For a bundle, I guess I'll take it. We got these list ones as well. Three lists. And then, of course, we got our lovely art cards. Nothing was signed, but, uh, I mean, we did get the... The good old Arlen. I mean, we didn't have any luck, especially with this. We're gonna say a five. It's an 18. Nowhere close. All right, y'all. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and uh, smash that bell button for all future notifications. Until next time, guys, Feldy. Peace. Thank you for coming to our show, and good night.